Matthew chapter 6, verse 33. But seek first his kingdom and his righteousness, and all these things will be given to you as well. could have worked on a better name. Like... The Funno Coaster! Or... The Mountain Funnatron! Or... The Funda Strike Gongatron! Yeah, the Funda Strike Gongatron! You ready to go? You bet! Let's go! Sorry, Callie. Hey, friends. Chip got a little scared of how high the Land of Fun Ride goes. I mean, Funda Strike Gongatron goes. So he decided not to ride. It's okay, Callie. You should go without me. I'll wait here with your parents. It will be... fine. <sighs> I really want to go on the ride, but it seems like where I really need to be is with Chip, my best friend. What should I do? Let's check out our Bible story while we try to figure it out. It's time for today's Bible story. It comes from the book of Luke, chapter two. When Jesus was 12 years old, he and his family went to Jerusalem for a festival. A festival is like a really big party. After the party, the family was on their way home. Jesus' parents didn't know that he had stayed behind and was still in Jerusalem. When they realized that he wasn't with them, they began to look everywhere. They went back to Jerusalem and found Jesus in the temple. The temple was where people hung out to talk about God. The things that they talked about was stuff that only grown-ups could understand, but Jesus was able to understand it all. In fact, he surprised everybody by how much he knew, even though he was just a young boy. Jesus' parents were upset. They asked Jesus, why did he scare them like that and stay behind without telling them? Jesus didn't mean to upset his parents. He just loved God so much that he told them he would be in his father's house, which was a temple. Even as a very young boy, Jesus knew we can love God with our actions.
Hands up, hands down. Now turn yourself around. Hands up, hands down. Now turn yourself around. Hands up, hands down. Now turn yourself around. They say you're short, too tall. You try and give your all. And then sometimes you fall. Oh man, that can't make sense at all. But God directs us. Yes, He loves us. We can follow Jesus because He leads us. You're growing bigger and so much stronger. God has this message for you. You should consider. You measure up. You measure up. You measure up, up. You measure up. Or maybe We can love God with our actions With zero distraction God makes us ready At the right time Always, always at the right time Of all the voices And all the noises God's words help us Make wise choices You measure up Jesus was so young, but he still did things that showed he loved God. And in the story, he knew exactly where he should be. In his father's house. I really want to go on the fun mountain ride, but I love my buddy Chip, and I don't think going on the ride without him would show that. I know what I'm gonna do. Hey Chip! Let's go find another ride to go on together! Really? You mean it? Yeah, it wouldn't be the same without you. Aw, oh, thanks. That means a lot. Oh, oh look, the line is really short for the Gizzard Gulch Fling Swing. Now that means more like it. Let's go! Friends, I could have gone on the ride without Chip, but I love my best friend, and I wanted my actions to show it. Jesus stayed in the temple because he loved God, and his actions showed it. We can love God with our actions. Gizzard Gulch Fling Swing, here we come. Thanks for learning and growing with me. Bye. Mountains and trees, your goodness never ends. You are great, and I know every day as I grow, you are my closest friend. Your glory fills me with wonder, cause you, my God, do amazing things. Your glory fills me with wonder, cause you, my God. Mountains and trees, your goodness never ends.